Nearly the date of the World Cup is coming. Everyone is focused on going to Qatar. In this video, we are going to talk about Qatar World Cup 2022. In 2022, FIFA World Cup will be contested in 2000 is due to take place in Qatar from November 21st to December 18, 2022. It will be the first World Cup to be held in the Arab world and the second World Cup to be held entirely in Asia after the 2002 tournament between South Korea and Japan, United States, Mexico, and Canada. Due to the intense summer heat in Qatar, the World Cup will take place from late November to mid-December, making it the first tournament not to be held in May, June, or July, which is also Qatar's national day. The reigning World Cup champion is France. In May 2011, allegations of corruption within senior FIFA officials cast doubt on the legitimacy of the 2022 World Cup to be held in Qatar. Bribery allegations have been made over how Qatar obtained the right to host the event. An internal FIFA investigation and report cleared Qatar of any charges, but principal investigator Michael J. Garcia has since described FIFA's report on his investigation as containing numerous materially incomplete and inaccurate testimonies. On May 27, 2015, the Swiss Federal Prosecutor's Office opened an investigation for corruption and money laundering in connection with the candidatures for the 2018 and 2022 World Cups. On August 6, 2018, the former FIFA president, Sepp Blatter, claimed Qatar used black ops, suggesting the games committee cheated to secure the hosting rights. In addition, Qatar has been harshly criticized for its treatment of foreign workers involved in World Cup preparations, with Amnesty International citing forced labor and poor working conditions, while many migrant workers say they have been granted excellent paying jobs. An investigation by The Guardian newspaper found that many workers are being denied food and water, having their identity documents taken away, and not being paid on time or at all, leaving thus some of them behind them, believes The Guardian. 4,000 workers could be involved in the competition and die from insufficient safety and other causes. Between 2015 and 2021, the Qatari government passed new labor reforms to improve working conditions, including a minimum wage for all workers and the abolition of the kafala system. According to Amnesty International, the living and working conditions of foreign workers in Qatar have improved and not improved in recent years. The 2022 World Cup is the first in the 92-year history of the tournament to be played in a Muslim country, with such strict social taboos on alcohol. Since FIFA chose the host country in 2010, questions have been raised about how Qatar would welcome fans who want to drink alcohol. The following year, FIFA extended a sponsorship deal with Brewer, Budweiser, Anheuser-Busch until 2022. That partnership began at the 1986 World Cup. During the 2014 World Cup in Brazil, local lawmakers, under pressure from FIFA, passed a special law that exempts the tournament from the ban on the sale of alcohol in stadiums. Qatar organizers were initially opposed to serving alcohol in stadiums, but a decade ago they promised to come up with a plan that welcomes everyone. The draw for the World Cup group stage took place on April 1, 2022 in Doha, Qatar, to set the stage for the tournament. The last three qualifying spots were filled in June with Wales, Australia, and Costa Rica complete as hosts Qatar have automatically qualified for next year's tournament, Brazil the most successful national team in World Cup history with five trophies, qualified as one of the top four teams in the South American groups. England secured their place in November by finishing top of their qualifying group. Portugal, Poland, and Wales advanced to the final after winning their respective playoff finals. The Group A, Qatar, Ecuador, Senegal, Netherlands. Group B, England, Iran, USA, Wales. Group C, Argentina, Saudi Arabia, Mexico, Poland. Group D, France, Australia, Denmark, Tunisia. Group E, Spain, Costa Rica, Germany, Japan. Group F, Belgium, Canada, Morocco, Croatia. Group G, Brazil, Serbia, Switzerland, Cameroon. Group H, Portugal, Ghana, Uruguay, South Korea. 
Four matches are played each day during the Al Bayt Stadium, Khalifa International Stadium, Al Thumama Stadium, Ahmad Ben Ali Stadium, Lusail Stadium, Ras Abu Abud Stadium, Education City Stadium, Al Janoub Stadium. With a population of 2.9 million, Qatar is one of the richest countries in the world thanks to its oil and gas exports. It has built seven stadiums especially for the tournament and a brand new city where the final will take place. In addition, more than 100 new hotels, a new metro, and new roads are under construction. The tournament's organizing committee estimates that 1.5 million people will attend the final. Qatar is a conservative Muslim country, and fans have been warned to be wary of their behavior. Any extramarital sex that takes place during the 2022 World Cup in Qatar could result in a seven-year prison sentence. It's the first time a World Cup has been staged in a Gulf country, which means there are cultural differences that many viewers may struggle to adjust to. When Qatar 2022 kicks off in November, it will be the first World Cup finals to be held in the Middle East or at this time of year. The decision to play the match in Qatar has sparked much controversy. The World Cup finals will be held between November 21st and December 18th, when temperatures in Qatar typically reach 25 degrees Celsius, 77 degrees Fahrenheit. Had the finals been held as usual in June and July, the matches would have been played in temperatures above 40 degrees Celsius and possibly even 50 degrees Celsius. Now we are at the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon. Take care.